name is Priya and today I'll be reading you The Perfect Rock. Here's the verb. Ollie, Fee and Ola do everything together. They play in the waves, eat shellfish feasts and snuggle up together to sleep. But there comes a day when every young otter must find a special rock of their very own. One shiny and strong enough to crack open shells for themselves. What will happen when there's just one perfect rock and three eager otters? Stay tuned to find out. Let's read. Every otter worth their sea salt knows the perfect rock is hard to find. But Ollie, Bee and Ola don't have time to think about rocks because, well, they have a busy schedule. And after a long day, nothing hits the spot more than a shellfish feast. Now, all you need is something to open shells with so you can have feasts all on your own. Ollie, Bee and Ola do love shellfish. It takes time to find the perfect rock for passes. So it's important to know what to look for. The perfect rock is tough, Mama says. Tough enough to break the hardest shells. Don't forget smooth, Papa says. Smooth enough to dance in your paws. Most importantly, they say, your rock must be something you hold dear. Something you'll hold tight and never lose. Together, they venture through forests and glide through skies in search of the perfect rock. They search high tide and low tide until finally, it's tough, Ollie says. Tough enough to break the hardest shells. And smooth, says B. Smooth enough to dance in my paws. I love it, says Ola. They all do. But there is only one. The perfect rock will fit perfectly in my pouch, says Ola. But I saw it first, whines Ollie. But I have it now, says B. And you can't catch me. They spring and splash, turn and twist, fumble and... The perfect rock is gone. Ollie, Bee and Ola don't look at each other the whole swim home. Not when they pass the slippery looking slide. Not even when they spy a funny looking fish. They're too angry and too sad. But when the waves start moving in a quicker, scarier rhythm, they remember to hold each other tight. I'm sorry, they all say, feeling lighter already. Who needs that old rock anyway, Ollie says. There are lots of rocks, Ola says. Maybe there's still a perfect one for each of us. The perfect rock is tough. Tough enough to weather the storm. It is smooth, smooth enough to ease worries big and small. Most importantly, the perfect rock is steer enough to hold tight and never lose. That is what every otter worth their sea salt knows. Thank you so much for joining me to read tonight. I hope you have a great night and if you'd like to see my next book, remind mum and dad to subscribe. See you next time.